<sighs> is Jupiter a failed star? To start with, Jupiter is made up of hydrogen and helium, the same elements as our Sun. But it is not massive enough to create the internal pressure and temperature needed to fuse hydrogen into helium. Basically, Jupiter would need to be about 75 times more massive to ignite nuclear fusion in its core. Hence, Jupiter is called a failed star, because it has the same ingredients as a star but didn't grow massive enough to ignite. Hmm. Why is the color of space black? According to a study, the space appears black because the universe is expanding. This expansion is causing the visible light emitted by the stars to stretch out so much that when it reaches our eyes, they cannot detect it. As our eyes cannot detect any visible light, the space appears black to us. Moreover, light has a specific speed limit. So, light from faraway stars has not even reached us. Thus, the space appears black. What is a supermoon? Simple. This is a supermoon. Oh, chum pum. Supermoon is a full or new moon that nearly coincides with perigee. Perigee is the moon's closest point to the Earth in its monthly orbit. This results in a moon which appears larger than its usual size when observed from Earth. The technical name for the same is perigee syzygy, as in roughly straight line configuration of Earth, Moon, and the Sun. The term supermoon is attributed to astrologer Richard Knoll. Out of the possible 12 or 13 full or new moons each year, usually three or four may be classified as supermoons. Hmm. How was the asteroid belt formed? No idea. But Chum Pum loves to jump on the asteroids. Oh, Chum Pum! About 4.5 billion years ago, our sun was formed from a huge cloud of gas and dust. Leftover cloud of gas and dust started spinning around the sun. These bits began to collide and stick together and slowly converted into planets. But still small bits of rocks were left over. These are called as asteroids. Most of these asteroids got pulled by Jupiter's huge gravitational pull and eventually formed an asteroid belt between Jupiter and Mars. Hmm. Why does Saturn have rings? Simple, because Chum Pum gifted it to huh? Saturn. Oh, Chum Pum! One theory suggests <laughs> that Saturn's rings are remnants of celestial bodies like a moon or a comet. Hmm. Billions of years ago, a celestial body may have got too close to Saturn. Hence, the side facing Saturn was pulled more strongly as compared to the side facing away. So, this inconsistent gravitational pull may have ripped apart the celestial body into pieces. Finally, these pieces might have started revolving around Saturn, thus forming its beautiful rings. Hmm. What if Earth started dancing? No big deal. Huh? Can the Earth dance like this? Oh, chum pum. Firstly, if Earth started dancing, humans will not be able to stand still anymore. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth started dancing, Earth's skyscrapers might start breaking down. Mm. Lastly, if Earth started dancing, Earth may start spilling its water on its neighbors. Mm. What if Earth was made of diamonds? Awesome! Now Chum Pum can easily read at night. Oh Chum Pum! Firstly, if Earth was made of diamonds, even black holes might start getting attracted towards the Earth. Secondly, if Earth was made of diamonds, humans might take Earth completely apart. Mm. Lastly, if Earth was made of diamonds, Earth may now start charging for selfies. Mm. What if Earth became half Jupiter? Cool! Now Chum Pum can easily go to vacation on Jupiter. Oh Chum Pum! Firstly, if Earth became half Jupiter, Earth's Jupiter half may become way too big. Secondly, if Earth became half Jupiter, Earth's Jupiter half may always be accompanied by Jupiter's 100 moons. Hmm. Lastly, if Earth became half Jupiter, Earth's original half may start hiding from Jupiter's great red spot. Hmm. What if Earth became half moon? No big deal. Chum Pum will become half sun. Oh, Chum Pum. 
Firstly, if Earth became half moon, Earth may now say goodbye to the original moon. Secondly, if Earth became half moon, Earth's moon half may keep on changing its shape. Lastly, if Earth became half moon, Earth may now have to order moon glasses. What if Earth became an asteroid? No big deal! Asteroids are nothing in front of Chum Pum. Oh, Chum Pum! Firstly, if Earth became an asteroid, then just like an asteroid, even Earth may now be surrounded by fire. Secondly, if Earth became an asteroid, Earth may shift over to the asteroid belt. Lastly, if Earth became an asteroid, other asteroids may carry Earth away. Mm. How was the asteroid belt formed? No idea. But Chum Pum loves to jump on the asteroids. Oh, Chum Pum! About 4.5 billion years ago, our sun was formed from a huge cloud of gas and dust. Leftover cloud of gas and dust started spinning around the sun. These bits began to collide and stick together and slowly converted into planets. But still small bits of rocks were left over. These are called as asteroids. Most of these asteroids got pulled by Jupiter's huge gravitational pull and eventually formed an asteroid belt between Jupiter and Mars. Hmm. What if Earth became triangular? No big deal. Even Chum Pum can get triangular. Oh, Chum Pum. Firstly, if Earth became triangular, all of Earth's skyscrapers huh? might fall off its triangular slopes. Mm. Secondly, if Earth became triangular, humans standing on the edges of Earth may keep on wobbling. Mm. Lastly, if Earth became triangular, huh? Huh? planets may start running away from Earth's sharp edges. Mm. What if Earth became half sun? No ways. I just want my whole Earth. Oh, chum pum. Firstly, if Earth became half sun, our original sun may leave the solar system. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth became half sun, Earth's neighbors, as in Venus and Mars, may start wearing sunglasses. Hmm. Lastly, if Earth became half sun, huh? Earth's precious satellites may start melting away. What if Earth was made of gold? Cool! Now Earth is Chum Pum's best friend! Oh, Chum Pum! Firstly, if Earth was made of gold, aliens may start pulling planet Earth from both sides. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth was made of gold, instead of with the sun, planets may start taking selfies with Earth now. Hmm. Lastly, if Earth was made of gold, all the humans will suddenly get very, very rich. Hmm. 